Oh my goodness, I'm so disappointed I couldn't show you the gameplay before this one, folks. I finally got Tenacious Rebounder, and my last game I had 32 rebounds. I'm going to show you proof of that in my attribute video coming up right before the playoffs. Well, actually, here's a look at some of my attributes. <laughs> actually, all of them. Anyway, I'm going to show you a more in-depth look at all this stuff in my... right before the playoffs. But I'm moving on to this game against the Miami Heat. What's going on, everybody? It's the man of our QJB, a.k.a. Cleveland. I got this NBA 2K15, my career fight, featuring a hometown hero, Bees from the East. Real deal. Neil. Still. Bridges. So here we are going up against Miami. Look at me running over D Wade. I don't care. But last game, I had 32 rebounds, folks. It was crazy throwing it up. Get Trey by foul. Look at that. So I did change up my jump shot. I went ahead and picked up Lance Stevenson. K Spade told me that was a good jump shot. So, of course, I'm going to take his advice. He's a shooter, you know what I mean? So, I had to pick that jump shot up. And I'm liking it so far now. Moving right along. Thinking about what I'm going to do in my next video is I'm going to try to get zero points and try to win on Hall of Fame. You know what I'm saying? So, make sure you stay tuned for that video. That will be my next My Career. Anyway, I'm moving ahead of myself. Like I said, I ended up getting tenacious rebound. And I've been wanting that. Get that then, I am. I've been wanting that badge for a long time, and I finally completed that. The game that I got it in, I had 26 rebounds. Then when I had tenacious rebounding on bronze, I ended up getting 32 rebounds. But I went ahead and went silver, and I went gold. So I have gold tenacious rebounding. That one game where I had 26 boards, I had like three badges in one game, but I was live streaming those game plays, so I didn't get to upload those. Coming up, bridges got swag, bridges got swag, hard in the paint, and I'm dunking in the bad man. They wanna be like me, QJB. Bridges got swag, that's how it's gonna be. Bridges got swag, look at five. He looked like he wanted to get dunked on by Bridges. Look at his face. <laughs> he was happy, folks. That's not funny. But anyway, <laughs> you know I'm joking. Anyway, throwing it at. And I'm getting another three. They counted it. Jefferson got a foul, but they still gave me that three-pointer. But like I was saying, I was live streaming those games. And I didn't actually record them, so I didn't get a chance to upload those. But if you do want to see those gameplays, they are on my Twitch account, uh, twitch.tv slash QJBEAT, QJB. And make sure you go ahead and follow me on Twitch so, you know, and you won't miss another stream. Anyway, here I am coming down to the paint, bagging them up. Boop, hitting them with the fake, throwing it out to my man, Kimba Walker. Yak him! He's getting that long jump shot to go, and I get the assist on the play. So now I have a red ring of death. You know I'm on fire. They're bringing that double team, so I'm finding the open man all the way cross court. Is Lance Stevenson, and he's getting me another assist on the play right there. So check us out here. We're in the second quarter. My man Gary Neal wide open. Look at me snatching boards, folks. I'm doing my thing out of here. Going up strong, showing up my strength on that play, and getting that layup. So I am loving what my team is doing right now. We're clicking. We're playing great right before the playoffs. You know what I'm saying? Check me out hitting another three-pointer with this Lance Stevenson jump shot release. And this jump shot release is only like, I think, 100 VC or something like that. It's not very expensive. You can go in and get it for pretty cheap. And I've been having some pretty good success with it. You know what I'm saying? I was using MJ before this one. I do like the MJ jump shot also because I was using that one on my Marcus Jordan character. And if you haven't seen my Marcus Jordan series, by the way, make sure you go check it out on the Full House ENT. It's a great series. I'm using Marcus Jordan, the son of a legend, Michael. So anyway, here I am coming down to the paint once again. Move out of my way. You don't want to get dunked on by the beast. You know when I go down to the paint, I don't care who's down there, what their name is, when they got there, what they're wearing, what they ate for breakfast. I'm still going to come down and dunk. And look at me going up with that beautiful layup right there. I thought I was about to yam it once again, but Bridges laid it up. So end of the shot clock right here. I'm passing it over to my man. He gets that bucket to go. Was that Gary Neal doing his thing right there? He's been playing some quality minutes for us lately doing his thing. So we are in the fourth quarter. Clutch time, crunch time, whatever you want. 
you want to call it. Look at my man Jefferson getting that one. We were losing, and the score is now 81-82 Miami. So we need a stop right here. He misses it. I snatch another board. Don't call for it, Kemba. Trying to take this bad boy coast to coast. Look at Stevenson with the beautiful Euro step layup. And he gets it to go, folks. Check him out doing his thing. Now I'm in the paint. Oh, my man gets blocked. I get the board. And Stevenson is wide open, missing it. I get another board. And we're passing it back out, trying to set up the offense once again. This time, I'm going to take it all the way. I say, forget it. They want to miss layups. They want to miss jump shots. I'm going to go in and dunk it. You know what I'm saying? So we have 243 to go. And D Wade was starting to take over. He was taking advantage of having a smaller person guard. Well, this time he had Stevenson guarding him. But the first time, I think Kimba Walker was guarding him. It doesn't matter. He's still hitting that mid range 99.9% of the time. So now we're losing by one point. Miami has it. Everybody's on their feet cheering for their team. And now Norris Cole gets a fadeaway jump shot. We were playing good defense and everything, folks. They were still hitting everything. Check me out with the pump fake. My man Kimba throwing up, missing it. Al Jefferson right there with the offensive rebound and the layup. Cutting the game to one point. So we need to stop Miami here. There's only one minute left in this game. Bosch is coming down. He's fouled. Oh, my goodness. He fouled a jump shooter. But he misses the first free throw. Can you believe that? Let's see if he can get that one. And he does. So now we're down to less than a minute to go. You know I want the ball right here. I got to do something with it. I'm coming down, dogging it in the paint. I went right by Luau Dang and got that one to go. So here's Bosch again, getting fouled once again. Come on, team. Oh, he's getting fouled. He's at the line again. This time he makes the first free throw. Let's see if he can miss this one. And he does. Give me that board. Now it's time to be the hero, right? It's time for me to do something. I'm trying to get to the paint. Nothing is open for me. I'm passing it out to my man Kimba. Getting it back. Pump faking. Crossing over. Coming down. Hitting it with the fadeaway. And I get it. They call a timeout. Look at that beautiful shot by Bridges. And nothing but net. All we have to do is get one stop here. And we're going to get this victory. D Wade has it. I knew he wanted to do something with it. I'm guarding Luau. Dang, Bosch has it. They're moving the ball to Cole. Dang has it. Oh, I jumped for no reason. And he made it. No. <laughs> Can you believe that? Oh, my goodness. He caught me slipping. And we're not going to walk out of here with it. So that next My Career video, I'm going to try to win on a Hall of Fame with zero points. See if I can do it. And as always, folks, that net. Peace. Nice job out there tonight. Thanks, man. I had a nice little matchup. I was able to make some things happen. Too bad it was a losing effort. Hate to waste a solid game. Ain't nothing wasted out there, man. Yeah, I'm playing for the team, sure. But I got a future to think about. And if I fill it up, I get paid. Plain and simple, all right? Yeah, I feel bad that the team lost. Of course. But I do feel good that I played well and I showed my stuff. You hear me? Only thing I hear is an arrogant young dude with an ego problem. Later, man. Enough already. It must have been that girl I met at that restaurant on 89th. I knew I shouldn't trust her. I left my phone on the table while I was talking to a friend. She sent messages to all my clients. This is all on me. 100% my fault. He was just playing. He knew we'd never discuss another team while we're still under contract here. You gotta believe me, man. So, is that how this all went down? Just a big misunderstanding that started with a stolen cell phone? Sir, I don't know how that message got sent or leaked out publicly, but I want to let you know I'm 100% behind our team. I'm ready to play in our next game in our uniforms right here at home. I'm ready to go like always. That's good enough for me, son. Now get back to work. And you. 
I suggest you password protect that phone of yours. Already done. Man, come on. Go.